sisters. General Sima Bathuri Anu. I am a general of an ancient army long ago. And we fought these reptilians long ago. We defeated them long ago. Only I had been here for the remainder of the duration of that invasion. This right here in my ancient self wouldn't have happened. And I know a lot of you brothers and sisters can't concur to this. We lost a lot during that battle. Whatever they use caused us to fuse. All right, because many of us were titans. Many of our bodies, our ancient bodies are now mountains and hills. Yes. See, so re remember who you are. Remember who you are. See, when you talk about ownership, it's not just ownership, it's that you are. We are the air, we are the water, we are the land, we're the fire, we're the wind, we're the crystals, the minerals, the metals, we are all of that. Yes, we, we are the everything and the all. And there is nothing that we are not. We have carried ourselves in a manner to which we have made ourselves an enemy, not knowing that there is an enemy who has manipulated our minds to make us think outside of us. That's why they keep using that mental shit. I got brothers that work talking about, man, you, you heard what Puff Daddy said, man? You heard what Puff Daddy, Puff Daddy's dead. The original Puff Daddy, he dead. That's a clone. You see what I'm saying? They kill the originals and they create clones and the clones don't have souls because the clones will do what the original won't do. All right? Clones will do what the original won't do. I saw I saw a, 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 a video of Usher with a dress on. That's a clone. Because the real Usher is dead. See what I'm saying? See what I'm saying, brother and sisters? So the thing about it is in our original state, this wouldn't be happening. They've got so many of us under spells. There's a spell, and they made it strong. And we're breaking the spell, which means that we've got to get back to the warriorship that we belong to. All right? We've got to get back to the warriorship that we belong to. We've got to get back to, to the point of seeking for the destruction of our enemies. You see, they have literally told themselves and told us had us tricked all our lives that they own this land because this land belongs to America America is a bank the United States is a corporation understand that America is a bank but that bank is broken the United States is a corporation and they want us to be corporations under the United States Corporation so that we can fund the American banking system. Brothers and sisters, what did we tell you all long ago? We say, use this money to create weapons to fight against your enemies. There's so many of our brothers and sisters running out the clothes and shoes and cars and purses and glasses. No. What am I doing with the money? I'm building structures. I'm building devices. I'm allowing my soul to open up to the most powerful energies. I will lead you into battle, brothers and sisters, and you will not die. I will show you how not to die. You must become everything, and you must realize that everything that these Saxons created came from this planet. I realized it one day. I said, "I said, you know, I thought about it. I said they they brought chemicals from another world. 
then I, I thought about it and said, wait a minute, if they brought chemicals from another world, then wait a minute, we 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 are those chemicals because we are the cosmos. We're nature. We are we are literally everything. We are literally everything. Everything is who we are. And there is nothing that we are not. There's nothing that we are not. So they want to come with frequencies now. Oh, we have advanced. We're not the same. I came, the, the song, the song came up in my mind with Diana Ross. Do you know where you're going to? Tell me, do you know where are you going to? And I was like, oh, we just advanced on a whole different level. I was like, we just shot way up in the motherfucking sky. Yes, we did. We just literally took a height unknown to mankind and we literally just flourished. We've got to get ready for war, brothers and sisters. That's the, that's the whole key point. Getting ready for war. So, how do you how how do you prepare for such a thing? How do you prepare for such a, 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 fury, a, 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 a furious battle as war? How do you, how do you prepare for such? Number one, you have to go back into the darkness. You have to go to that to that closet where it's completely dark. There's no fear. Don't be scared. If you have to go into that dark forest, go into that dark forest. There's nothing to fear because you are the darkness. You must realize that. When they talk about Halloween, I love that shit. I love that shit because I'm like, shit, y'all have no idea what the fuck real fear is. So we got to get back into the darkness. First, you got to tap into the darkness. Your most That's the most important thing is tapping into the darkness, tapping into this, this infinite energy, this infinite power, the darkness, this dark forces, the dark energy. I link into the heart of the darkness. I link into the mind of the darkness. I mold my body into the shape and form of dark energy. I mold my soul into the form and shape of dark energy. I am the darkness that is within. I am the darkness on the outside. I am the darkness that created everything. I am the darkness that created every planet, every universe, every galaxy. I am the darkness that created the cosmos. I am the darkness. I am the power. I am the energy. I am life, I am death, I am fortune, I am fame, I am goodwill, I am the evil, I am the good, I am everything, I am everything, I am the everything that you could ever imagine, I am everything that ever could be imagined, I am the all. You have to return to the darkness. If you have to recite that a few times, you feel that energy like I feel it right now. It's a black fire and you can see that black fire in the spirit and you can see that fire that's churning up in your soul. It's right here. You got to get prepared. Fuck all the distractions. Fuck everything that these motherfuckers put out here because it is all designed to cause you to remain asleep you believe a little bullshit you believe the rest of it don't tell us they own land because they put something on paper you walk up to a land and then they write on a piece of paper I run shall once can whiskey on this land from this part to this part to this part 
and then sign his name and then have somebody else say, I need a witness to sign it. Yeah, see, that's how they did that shit. And then they gave it to us. And then in our lower state, we believed that shit. And we let them have it. Now we realizing you don't own shit. You want us to pay taxes and rent and levies on shit that belongs to us. Y'all motherfuckers don't belong to this planet. And we're getting ready to war against you. I don't know about the other brothers and sisters who who want to fall under all these popular YouTubers and whatever. But what I do know is the brothers and sisters who are on this channel here. Y'all ready for war? See, it's going to be very few of us who are actually going to be at war real war where we're going to be using the powers and energies and then those who are fast asleep are going to be like why can't I do that because no you didn't want to follow this channel you didn't want to do that you didn't want oh because he ain't like Rashad Jamal he ain't like ISIS wisdom good 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 keep it up keep it up we're getting ready to move into a whole nother era of power a whole nother era of power and this is what brother Bobby Hammett was talking about he was talking about this see these motherfuckers think that they can they own the land oh we can do whatever we want to do we can spray whatever we want to spray in the sky we can put whatever we want to put into the water we can we can dig up grounds and, and we can do what we want to do that's what they think warriors get ready for battle because very soon we're going to be going to battle the atmosphere is changing and it's not in their favor. Everything around us is shifting, it's changing. You see, they got their planes up in the sky constantly trying to make it cold. No, 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 no. See, we are gearing closer to our galactic sun. And it's not going to take long to get right there in the middle of the process where they're going to feel the power. And they're, they're, they're literally going to know that they fucked up. But check this out. They ain't got nowhere to go. Because we locked the planet down. We locked it down. So they won't go nowhere. So the only thing they can do is accept death. Or say, you know what? I, I've always been good to y'all black people. And be like looking around like, where the fuck is a black person? Where? You t can you tell me where you can find a black person? Tell me where the fuck you can find a black person. Because I don't see no black people around here. I see dragons. That's what I see. Because we come from the dragon bloodline. Dragons are peaceful in nature. But when it comes to war, rage and fury comes from the most deepest part of the bosom of our souls. You understand what I'm saying? We are that bloodline. We are that dragon bloodline. We are that powerful bloodline that is an ancient bloodline. We see, we, we fall under the ancients. We fall under the ancient and the old. That's what we fall under. All right? We are an ancient people. We are an old people. There is nothing about us that is modern. And this is why the system wants to modernize us wants to transform our mind into the ways that they live henceforth I'll give you a position and I'll put it on paper but then I can take that position away from you that I gave you one thing they can't take away from us we're nature we're nature on the fullest level and they can't take that away from us we're nature in the fullest aspect of life. They can't take that away from us. See, this is something that we inherited. This is not something that that was put on paper. They can write down. Okay, well, this you're you're, you're going to be nature, and, and you're going to be black, and you're going to be this. And no, 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 no. See, they they can't they can't they can't do that. You got to get ready for war. You gotta go into the darkness. And this is this is a thing that you gotta do. So I say, oh, I wish I could do this, wish I no, 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 no. If I was standing in front of you right now, giving you all this information, guess what? 
you still have to do it yourself. You still have to do it yourself. You still have to have to go into the dark places yourself. You still have to face that part of you. You got to go into that dark space. You got to look at your face. You've got to see who you are. And when you see that dragon, when you see that dragon, you have viewed yourself. See that dragon that you see when you go into the darkness, that's your higher self. You see, we're different dragon entities of this realm. We carry that bloodline. This is why our, which is called DNA, is a perfect match because our realm is nothing but a dragon. We told you those who are called Africans, why didn't they match? Because they are galactic refugees. They come from a completely different uh, a star system within this galaxy. They came here because, well, they were invaded by the reptilians. And now the same reptilians that they fought against long ago before they came here, same reptilians are here. And they still giving in to those same beings. And those reptilians are trying to say, oh, you you remember your ancestors, your ancestors, they trying to pull up old shit from, a other, from, from another planet. You understand that? They pull up old shit from another planet and they believe in this shit. We got war, brothers and sisters. We got war. There is there is much that we have to do. They want to say, "Oh, this is this these these are American grounds." No, motherfucker, the land is Atlantis, and it still is Atlantis. This land is the heart of this entire realm. This land right here that they call America, which is Atlantis, this land is the heart of the entire realm. This land is where the heart beats. And we, as the original beings, are the heart of this realm. Tell you all, that's why they fight so hard against us. Because they know who we are. They know who we are. And they're going to continue to fight as long as we don't fight back. But when you wake up and you see the powers you have. You understand who you are. And you understand that you are literally the most dominant force of power ever. And the thing about it is when you go so deep into yourself, it's not so much of I got to make this move. I make this move right here. You just think it. You think you think because you have control of your spirit mind you have control so you think it and therefore you think it it happens because you are a part of nature see this is what they want to remove you from this is why you have all the video games and the uh what's that what's that what's that virtual reality games and and all the money and the things and television shows and all that see they they got all this right here so that you won't think like the ancestors they don't want you to think like the ancestors they want you to think like them they want you to be a part of that program you have to return into the darkness you have to return to the forces I link into the most powerful dominant dark energy ever known that I may become this you are the darkness you the force you the power you the energy Yura Sawata Kaliza Shiro Nokumote Lala Una 
And there's no one who can remove you from this. There's nothing that they can use against you. You are the all powerful. You're the all powerful. Yara Kazara Wala. Nurashala Idearasha. There's no one who can take this away from you. There's no one. But you are the most powerful. Know who you are. Know who you are. Know that you are everything. And most of all, you're the cosmos. You are the cosmos. You're the most powerful force ever known. You walk around, you talk. The cosmic language is within you. The ways of the cosmos is within you. All of them link into these forces, link into these powers, link into these dominant energies and you will see you're the darkness. Must remember inner peace, inner peace, inner peace. Because inner peace literally dominates over everything. Which means you have that inner peace, which means that there is no fear, there's no doubt, there's no frustration, there's no anger. There's just power. And you think it, and it becomes. Because you can get to a certain point of power where you as this original being can blow fire from your mouth, lightning from your eyes. Your five fingers can literally control everything, earth, wind, water, fire, spirit. The five powers, five energies, why you think they said the first five civilized tribes? One of them represented earth, one represented water, one represented fire. Okay? One represented spirit. You got earth, wind, water, fire. You want you got one represented earth, one represented wind, one represented water, one represented fire, one represented spirit. You see the first five civilized tribes. And they knew the powers that we have. But when they use our towers and our temples that we created and they set those frequencies out because they had to, they had to find a way to make us fall. They destroyed the tree of life. Okay, we knew that. But then they used the frequencies from our buildings to put us under a spell. And many of those frequencies are still standing, many of those buildings are still standing, those frequencies are still coming through those buildings, like over in what you call uh, uh, Italy and all that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, you got to remember these frequencies go across the air. Now, what we have learned, we have learned that we can absorb these frequencies, that we can become these frequencies. And this is how we control everything. We become that which wants to destroy us. They showed us in the movie, in that cartoon, um, um, uh, Silver Surfer. And he was getting pulled into a black hole. And he said, if I fight against it, the more I fight against it, it's going to pull me in. So I must absorb its energy and I must become this black hole that I may release myself from it. You understand that? I'm going to say it again. Cause this is what Silver Surfer said. The craziest part about it is can't find that cartoon anymore. You know, I don't know where to find it because it was on YouTube for a long time, and I and I watched pretty much damn near all of them. And Silver Surfer said he got stuck into a black hole, and he said if I fight against this black hole, the more I fight against it, it will pull me in, and I will be lost in oblivion. But he said I must absorb this energy I must become the black hole and therefore I will be released from it and he absorbed the energy of the black hole and he became that black hole and he was released from it 
you understand this message? Everything that they're doing out here, you must become it. You must become it. Just like you said, oh, you got guns? I am everything. I am the metal in that gun. I am the plastic in that gun. I am the bullet that gun was that gun uses. I am everything. And they want to fire the trigger, pull the trigger, and nothing happens. Or if they pull the trigger, it blows up in the hands. Because now everything is working against them. We are the ancient dragons, and this is what the dragons did. We literally became the different energies. It's just that so many brothers and sisters lost track when our tree of life was destroyed. When that tree of life was destroyed, we lost track of everything. Now it's time for us to come back. Because that same tree of life that was on the physical is now within us. You absorb the energy. You say, I absorb the energy of the tree of life. I am now the tree of life. I am now this power. I am now this energy. I am now this force. I am now the tree of life. I contain the frequencies, the essence, the vibrations. All of the tree of life is within me. The tree of life dealt with, with nothing but pure darkness. The darkest of energy, the darkest of powers. Henceforth, we must begin building again, brothers and sisters. All of the, the, the aspects of building and creating are within us. You just have to become the energy. You have to become it. The ancient dragons, the ancient powers, the ancient energies. Remember who you are, brothers and sisters. Never forget. We have a long history ahead of us. And our history and our legacies goes back as far as the cosmos can go. Just like we said in, in the previous message. Your past lives are infinite. There's nothing that, 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 they, that these beings can say to you. No. Because they know that you live forever. This is why they're trying to find everlasting life. We want to live forever. We want to live forever. You, you were not designed to live forever. Your creators created you in incubators and laboratories. Some off-world shit in another universe somewhere. You're here trying to play the role like... No. No. Even your your hybrid children won't last long. No. No. Remember, the only reason why they wanted their children to be born from us is because they felt like their children could have some inheritance of this land. Maybe the carbon part of them could have inheritance. There's a part of them when nature says, you know what? You have limitations. Some part of nature says you can't go there. See, they carry a dragon bloodline and a reptilian bloodline. That's what the whole point of that that uh, predator versus alien versus predator. When you had the hybrid come out. The predator, the original beings, the dragon bloodline. The alien is the reptilian beings. Yes. And they created hybrids. We're going to war. And we're going to make sure we bring this in. in. Learn how to absorb all this shit, brothers and sisters. All right. Learn how to absorb all this energy. All this power. With dragon beings. All power to the multi chakra celestial and jelly beings. May chaos run with you forever and ever and ever. Remember, chaos is everything. Your chaos, brothers and sisters. Much power to you all.